and welcome back to Adora Build. My name is Ruth and my little dog is called Pucky. And today we're checking out another one of the Lego Dots sets, which happens to be the fantastic pineapple pencil holder. So on screen we are just taking everything out of the box and we're starting to build this little pencil holder up. So you can see here that we just use a few plates and a few bricks in order to create a really great foundation. And I think that it is important to note that we are using some of those yellow bricks with the studs on the side in order to secure our plates to the side later on. And I really like this technique that the dots have used in order to sort of have those plates where we can create the patterns on them but it also means that it's really easy to be able to take the plates off and put them back on again when we want to change the design out. Obviously we're now adding those plates to the side, we've finished off the top and we're now making the lid of the pineapple pencil holder. So you can see here a few different shades of yellow and a few different shades of green. I do really love the way that we've created that little leaf piece on top and I think that it's absolutely awesome that it spins around. We're now creating a little bit of a side build completely off camera, fixed it, <laughs> but this is like a little watermelon side build thing which is quite cute. I'm not too sure what you would store in it. I think the image on the box art was paper clips. Now of course we open up our actual dots bags and what I thought I would do for my watermelon and pineapple would be to create these cute little faces and the designs for these faces are actually included in the dots instructions as an example of what you can do. So this little face I thought was really cute with the smiles and the little pink cheeks and I added in some pineapple pieces hair on top with some of those yellow cord around pieces on a little bit of an angle and then on the reverse of that so the opposite side I decided to create the face with the sunglasses and the quirky little eyebrows which then leaves these two plates which were on the sides in order to create more original designs. So I did have a little bit of a play around in order to come up with a design that I actually liked and there were sort of certain elements that I liked in that first example. And then I had another little sort of play around and experiment for the opposite side. And I came up with a little bit more of a different type of an example that I wanted to use with the two different shades of yellow and the two different shades of green. I did try and add in some of that neon coral, but it was just too much of a contrast with everything else that I had going on. And then I decided that I did want to make the two side panels actually match. So I thought that that was a really lovely little design feature. So that was my little pineapple holder in the end. So as you can see here, we now have our little pineapple holder and watermelon container as well and it's just a really cute and fun little build. As always, I do hope that you have enjoyed watching my videos. If so, make sure that you do give it a big thumbs up. It would be really nice to have you join me as one of my subscribers as well. I do create really regular content. Until my next video, take care of yourselves and bye-bye.